everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to start a little bit of a mini series, Beauty Basics. I'm going to walk you through on how to do your winged liner, how to do your eyebrows, and apply false lashes, and a bunch of other little things that girls or women who aren't as comfortable with makeup or are just starting out can learn these basic um, techniques and little tips and tricks and so hopefully you know I'm just gonna keep these short and I'm gonna upload them sporadically and just kind of give you your beauty basics so today's mini series on beauty basics is how to apply winged liner so if you want to see how to get a good wing liner every time just keep watching all right today we are using max fluid line gel liner in the color black track and this has been my favorite gel liner for so many years. To apply it, we are using an E65 brush by Sigma. This has been the tried and true brush. This makes it so much easier than any other brush that I've used. I don't know what it is, but it's amazing. <laughs> Starting at the corner of our eye, where our lower lash line would end, we're gonna draw a line straight up towards the tail of our brow. From there, we're gonna connect it and draw a line down towards the middle of our eye. I like to do this in one fluid motion. For me, I get a straighter line that way, but for you, you could take it just a small stroke at a time. Then I go in at the inner corner of the eye and draw a thin line. Now you can make this as thin or as thick as you want, but for me, I just like to keep it thin on the inner corner. Then you just start to fill it in, and I do short strokes for that so I don't get too crazy. Once you've filled it in, you can go back and smooth over any edges and uh, make anything thicker if you want to, but I warn you, do not go too crazy because you will end up with ridiculous liner if you go overboard trying to fix every little imperfection. <laughs> All right, so here we have one eye, so let's move on to the other eye. Again, starting at the corner of the eye, drawing a line up towards the tail of our eyebrow. Take a moment to make sure that your angle you just drew is the same as the other eye. Now you just take it from the top of that line all the way down to the middle of the eye, and then draw a thin line from the inner corner, and then fill it in. there you have it guys you can make it as bold or as classy as you want to but there is the basic technique all right and that is how you apply your winged liner you can use gel or liquid or pencil but for me I personally find gel to be the easiest solution for me to work with it glides on so smoothly it's very forgiving and I don't feel like my hand is as shaky <laughs> When I use liquid liner, it just intimidates me, so my hand is all over the place and that ink gets everywhere. So for me, personally, gel liner is the easiest, but you, it is just all about trial and error. You find out what works best for you and work with it and have fun. And don't forget that you don't have to just use black. You can use all different kinds of colors, have fun with it. I hope this helped you and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye guys. <laughs>